So we're back in this uh, outer courtyard and we're about to head through into the inner keep. Currently it's basically just a hole in the wall so I'm trying to figure out if I really want to sort of improve this much. Um, but sticking another tower here may make it a little cramped so I'm not sure at the moment. It's a fairly sizable wall above like it's a five wide wall so we'll see. But this is the inner courtyard and there are three big towers along the outer wall which sort of overlook down the hill and then there are three towers here uh, not quite as well these two are, are fairly big but the, the sort of there's a a, uh, a much smaller structure on on this end so what we'll do is we'll just go and have a look you can see here this is an entrance to a mine um, it's not really mine it's just sort of cabins that I discovered um, and there's a few of them uh, we'll head up on the wall for a start we can have a look around. So from here you can see out across the uh, across this frontal plains and these are these are fairly big towers as you can see um, heading up them got lots of decent sized stairs rather than those horrible little sort of two by two stairs and uh, there's the tower obviously that's where we came where we popped out of the tunnel there's a promenade or a whatever you call it a boulevard here, some trees, but I home is that way, off into the distance. Um, and I was planning on sort of building a bit more, but it takes forever. So, uh, and if we head back down, we'll head to one of the other towers. As you can see, this is the this courtyard, and there are smaller walls within it that like this wall for instance, I'll, uh, I'll go over and have a look. It doesn't really block anything off but um, it's just extra defense. So again entrance from the courtyard into here you go diagonally across and we have a outer courtyard um, with a nether portal so that I can and this big sort of curved wall which I rather like um, that takes us all the way out so we can see again out and around here. These, uh, there is actually a connection from this tunnel that ends up connecting in under the keep, which is a bit concerning. Um, so I'll probably have to fill that in. Um, but as you can see, so then if we head back in through here, and we'll go out onto the uh, sort of the far wall, I suppose you can call it. So this is at the very rear of the keep, and um, Keep continuing around, or just have a little look so you have the edge of yourself. And it's all uh, it's all stairs, so it's a bit jolty, but better than having to jump. As you can see, this is this is the I suppose you'd call them the, the rear planes. I really should have done north, south, east, and west. Would have made it a bit clearer. Um, there's a small side wall here which basically just protects a spur of the hill that sticks out um, and as you can see if we come around to this side this is where that oh this is where it drops around to that lower courtyard um, and it's pretty hard to get back up and into like that's that's the intention is to stop people from being able to get out from or get in from around there 